43 miles east of the giant 12,633-foot-tall Flagstaff Mountain at Flagstaff, Arizona, lies a very huge hole 570 feet deep and nearly three miles in circumference named Meteor Crater, but also referred to as Behringer Crater within the science community in honor of geologist Daniel Behringer. Daniel Behringer, whom was a geologist, a lawyer, meteorologist, and mining company owner, officially had the site proclaimed as a meteor crash site in the year 1902. Meteor Crater has been dated by geologists to be around 50,000 years old and the most well-preserved crater of its type on Earth. Eduardo Rubio whom is a very interesting and knowledgeable man, is the chief of tour guides at Meteor Crater and has appeared many times in international media as well as the history and discovery channels sharing his acquired knowledge of Meteor Crater. Rubio is also bilingual in both English as well as Spanish and he has guided tours at Meteor Crater since the year 2003. Christ of 92% iron, 7% nickel, and 1% tra trace elements that include iridium, platinum, cobalt, even industrial grade diamonds. The density, however, is what makes it so heavy. It's very dense. It weighs 1,406 pounds. It is probably worth several million. This solid iron meteorite is the largest discovered fragment of the meteor that created Meteor Crater, and it is on exhibit in the crater's visitor center. Meteor Crater still today remains a focus of scientific study to geologists and scientists from all around the world. During the 1960s, NASA astronauts trained inside the crater in order to prepare for the Apollo missions to the moon as well as moonwalks. Further research done here at Meteor Crater by scientists has led to the discovery of more previously unidentified ancient craters in Texas, the Chesapeake Bay, and southeastern Nevada. Meteor Crater receives about 30,000 visitors annually, and though it is privately owned, it is a designated national natural landmark of the U.S. For Old Cat 1959 News, near Flagstaff, Arizona, I'm Marvin Carter.